everybody, it's Cindy A. Lewis, and I want to welcome you to my channel today. Thank you so much for being a part of my YouTube family. I'm just doing a really quick video, so it didn't even do like an intro officially, but I do want to invite you to subscribe. Go over to the uh, June 1st video and enter to win the junk journal kit giveaway. It is going to be a drawing on June 1st. 30th. So you don't want to miss that. Check that out. But what I wanted to share with you today, I have a, a number of people that have been watching that are new to junk journals. And this is a little kit that you can get on Amazon that has like uh, about, I don't know, 200 pieces or so. It has um, everything you need really to get started. Now this one is green. They have different colored themes. But I wanted to just show you everything that comes with it for $11.99. So it's really, really cool. So you get five different washi tape rolls. Look at that. Now, I ordered the green one again, but you can order, you know, different color themes. So this is really pretty, and I thought it was very vintage looking. You also even get a tape runner. You get the small talk stickers. So you've seen these before. I use them frequently. I'm trying to find out where the front is here. But these are little quotes that you can add to any of your pages, your ephemera. And so you get the black with the white lettering. And you also get the white with the black lettering. And these are really fun to add to tags, journaling pages, and everything. And you can see there are so many here that you could easily, easily um, have leftovers. Now, what comes inside this little kit, we're going to open, is a lot of stuff. Now, I'm telling you, this is for $11.99. So you get a lot. Let me separate it out a little bit for you. All right, so I try to spread everything out that is in this kit. And it's really large and more than you could probably even use in one traveler's notebook. So this is a traveler's notebook. Traveler's notebook is about an eight inch piece that's folded in half. Um, it's I think it's about eight by eight folded in half. Um, these are really fun, great for beginners to start with because it's already put together for you. You just decorate the pages. So this is really uh, goes towards the vintage look. And again, it's the green. So it has these two large pieces of papers. They're folded in half when they come, but they're really fun. And you could use these as a layout to cover your pages or you could cut them if you'd like to. So you have these two large pieces. Then you have um, scrapbook paper. So you have these beautiful um, pieces that actually complement um, the large pieces. Let's see, come that upside down. And of course you can use them to decorate your pages and to cover your pages however you want to do that. Then you have these beautiful pieces. They are um, they are translucent, and you can't really see through them, but you can see that they're thin. But they look like homemade papers in a way, and they feel very um, like homemade. <laughs> I don't know how else to say it, but really beautiful. Then you also have these pieces here. These are actually stickers. I started to pull one, but I don't know if I still have it. Yeah. So you can see these squares are actually stickers. And they, of course, complement the other papers that we've already looked at. And they would be beautiful on your pages. Then you have these as well. And there are the taller ones, the rectangles. You have five of these as well. And they are also uh, sticker papers. So very nice. Then these translucent ones, they're like vellum. Um, they're very pretty. And I love the designs on here. So like this one has sort of a calendar on it. What well, probably is a calendar. Um, then you can just see these beautiful designs are just 
gorgeous. And um, then this lovely flower right here. So you have all of those. Then you have these, and these are a smooth surface. They're tags, so you can see you could punch out your uh, tag, and then they give you twine. So I'm telling you, if you just want to spend a small amount and get started on a journal, this is a great, great deal, because I can't even put this together for this. Um, then you have, these are all photo frames. So if I turn them on the back, you can kind of see where the perforation is to punch out for your photo. So you can keep this and use it as ephemera and decoration and then um, put your own photo behind it. So you've got this one, this one here, beautiful. Um, this lovely design here, I love this though. I probably wouldn't even punch it out. I, I just think it's so cute. And then uh, this one and these other two. So you can see the perforation right here. It'd be easy to punch out, but I didn't really want to do that yet. Okay, then you have these lovely circles. These are translucent as well. And very pretty like vellum. And so you can see the different designs that are included. Just beautiful. And then they gave you some tickets. So you have some really large ones. Then you have these as... Um, as well like theater tickets and then you have uh, this set again you could pull them apart or tear them uh, apart cut them apart and then not only that they give you these little bookmarks so look it's a little page bookmark that you can put on your page and use it in your journal so you can just stick it on there like that so they give you four of those and they're pretty designs so cute. And let's see, then they give you a whole set of washi stickers. So washi stickers are the ones where they're, um, they kind of blend in with the page. They don't really have a white background like some do. They're more um, the translucent. So look how pretty these are. Complimenting, again, that green, beautiful green, um, fresh nature look, really. And lovely um, designs again, to go with this journal. So I thought it would be fun to share something with those that maybe looking for the first time to do a journal and you would like something like this to help you get started and it provides just about everything that you could uh, want to use to get started. Now you could use this in scrapbooking as well if you didn't want to uh, make a journal you could do something like that. So this is really a beautiful kit for $11.99 on Amazon. I'll link it below and um, let me know what you think of it. I think it's a great gift also to give to someone if they are looking to get started in uh, creating junk journals. So what a great kit and I wanted to share that with you. So, the last thing that I wanted to do is nothing to do with this kit, but I got some happy mail from my friend Mary, and I wanted to share it with you. So, I'm just going to show you um, my card I got from her, and um, she is from Colorado. I don't think she'd mind me sharing that, and she made me a pretty card uh, with the kitties. She's thinking of the kitties. Oh, and she made me some tags. Thank you, Mary. Let's see, she just wanted to send me a small gift and thank me for the giveaways and stuff. Aww. Aww. So, these are really pretty. I love these little um, paper doll stickers. These are cute. I love the little lace for the pull on the tag. Look how cute these are. I love them, Mary. You sent me a lot. Thank you. How cute. I love these. I really do. And I love the music and the um, different, um, you know, book backgrounds. Oh, these are awesome. Thank you, Mary. Thank you for thinking of me. I'll treasure these and use them in a, a vintage um, journal that I made. So thank you so much. And I appreciate that so much. Okay, well, thank you, everybody, for watching. I hope this um, kit may help someone that's ready to get started to do something with junk journals. And um, 
give you all really the supplies that you could need, except for you might want to get some glue or something, but it does give you a tape runner to get you started. So thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. And until tomorrow, bye-bye.